God's presence and do what you've been doing a year ago. You ought to thank God that the church doors are open. Come on, let's thank God for the church doors. They're open. Don't stay at home. Online is for the folk that can't get to church. Y'all can get to church. The doors is open. Get to church. You're going to need it. You're going to need it. You're going to need a word to inspire you. I want to just decree and declare in this house today, God's blessings are upon your life. And when you go back home, mothers and fathers, make sure that when you walk through your door, begin to plead the blood over your house. You got that kind of power. Plead the blood over your house so that COVID or Delta won't be able to come in your house. And we plead the blood over the children. Yeah, they could, they, they could they, they tried to get the, the older people. They tried to get those that had underlying issues. But now they're going for our children. The devil is a liar. Come on, I need you to start speaking it. Going into your house, you put that blood on the doorpost and say in the name of Jesus, coronavirus, the Delta variant will not come into my house. Come on and clap your hands if you believe it. I decree and declare for the rest of your life. Come on, it's your time to praise God in the middle of what you're going through. That God is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all we can ask or think. Come on, all the praises that know you're free today. Come on, open up your mouth and praise Him under your mask. Praise Him. He hears you. He hears you. He hears every prayer of the righteous. Because the prayers of the righteous are well and much. Come on, if you're free today, you don't have to worry about what the enemy said and what he's plotting against you. God is able to bring you through it. Come on, if you believe it, clap your hands, open your mouth. That's a good place to shout, my God, what a message we heard today. A message of deliverance, a message of freedom. A message of letting everybody know that God is for me. He's more than the world against me. Therefore, I will bless the Lord at all times. In the midst of situations, in the midst of sickness, in the midst of family issues, in the midst of going through on your job, I'm going to bless Him. Why? Because every time I bless Him, God is working something out for me. If you believe it, that's a good place. If you know how to shout, you need to hold your head down. Get on that bench and let it help you out. Get your step on. I got to pray the why I got a chance. I may not make it back in here. I got to pray. Oh, bless your name. Come on. Praise him. With everything you got. Praise him. I'm free. I said I'm free. No more change. 
ain't a hole in me. I'm no longer bound. Oh, blessed name. God gave us the privilege, the honor, and an opportunity to open your mouth and bless his name for freedom today. Hallelujah. No longer in slavery. No longer bound to racism. No longer bound to what the enemy wants. Oh, I'm free today. So God, we thank you on behalf of your people. God, I pray that you touch, that you would deliver, that you would set us free. We bind the works of the enemy that tries his best to hold us. Put it to the slavery that has been around us. We bind it now in the name of Jesus. We speak freedom in this room. In the name of Jesus, we praise you. We magnify you. Give you glory and honor in Jesus' name. Thank God. Amen. Come on, put your hands together. Give God that praise that's deserved to Him.